Hello everybody, this is Kevin with Inspiring How You See That, where the inspirational channel goes beyond the scenes, interviews some of your favorite artists, entertainers, and much more. And we also do inspirational stories and we talk these Tech Tuesdays. So today we're gonna to be uh, back with another Tech Tuesday. And this was a, an exciting uh, a Tuesday uh, as far as that goes with the WeWalk camera. We had uh, done an unboxing. Uh, we were sent a camera from them. And the next step, as I said, we would be doing the uploading of the camera and kind of showing you guys how to do that. And we'll kind of give an overview of that. And then the next video, we'll be doing the testing of the, the uh, camera itself. So we're gonna talk a little bit about this. So as far as uploading it into the iPhone, it was actually uh, you know fairly simple to do. Um, just they also have a video right on um, their page as far as their app. And as you see here, I have, uh, right behind me, the app, the WeWa uh, camera app. And so far there's only, uh, you know, two reviews. This is, is a very, very uh, new uh, system and it hasn't been out very long. So basically you'll see here that the app we've already downloaded on our phone. Basically you download that app. So if you are gonna be getting this camera, download the app, uh, it's very quick. And then once you download the app, you'll see all the different camera uh, systems. And this was the small mini camera, the MW5. So we just basically clicked on that, brings you over to the next screen. And then when you get on the next screen, this is a big uh, key an important factor, making sure that the camera uh, itself is plugged in. So make sure it is plugged in and uh, powered up and then have your phone right next to it and be kind of close to your your router, your Wi-Fi, whatever it may be, um, is, a, is a big key factor. So we did all that, got that all set up, and then we went on to the next uh, the next step. So once that's done, we went through the, the you know, you just gotta basically read, you know, with the LEDs and the flashing and the blues and, if you guys have all done this with, uh, you know, setting up your Wi-Fi, you kind of know the basic ins and outs. If you haven't done this, it's very self-explanatory. And as I said, they also have a video there. Um, you can play the video and it will show you, it's it's right on this app. It'll show you basically how to do this. And if there's even an issue and it locks up, it'll show you how to redo it. Um, so once this is all programmed and the, uh, the LED is flashing as it says, uh, and, um, doing what it says then you just click on to the next step and then of course you'll type in uh, your basically your password your name whatever you want there uh, as you see it's all blanked out because we don't have ours on there uh, but it is on our phone and then this is kind of neat uh, the QR code you'll basically hold your camera um, which is in this box here you'll hold it up to the QR code and then it will scan it. Now make sure that you kind of, this is a key part. You know, a lot of times people just get into a rush and they try to hurry up, scan it. Oh, it's not working, it's not working. You know, and you just can't do that. You have to actually let it, give it a few seconds, uh, maybe 10, 20 seconds to finally go through and read uh, the camera. Now, if it doesn't work, then you're gonna have to redo this. But once it, it coordinates, it will go on to that next step and it'll actually bring the uh, the camera page up and say it's downloaded into your phone and then you'll be able to see it and you'll visually be able to see it. Now, in this video, we're not gonna show you the video of, of course that we have taken um, with the camera as of yet. And the reasoning why is because the main point, what I really wanted to get out to you guys out there and to test this camera before we really give it the full review is this camera is fully functional anywhere with Wi-Fi, meaning it's supposed to be able to go anywhere with Wi-Fi. As long as your phone is on that Wi-Fi, this camera will pick it up as long as it's coordinated into your phone in the correct Wi-Fi and set up. So what I'm gonna do is, um, there's gonna be a few instances where, you know, we may, you know, either be traveling or, or doing something in regards to that. And that's the particular use that I want for this camera. And I want to show you guys out there how it works. So that way, if you're anywhere or you're walking, you know, in, in, a, in a resort or, 
or an area, the office building, wherever you may be at that has the Wi-Fi and it works on your phone and you want that camera somewhere in there, maybe you're at your office and you want the camera you know, at your office desk and you have some important documents or materials and you wanna see who's coming in and out of your office. I don't know, whatever it may be used for, um, that's what we want to really try out and test out so that this, this, to see if this camera is a full floating camera. And what I mean by that is it, it will go basically anywhere, um, and work on the Wi-Fi. So that will be the next video. So this video is just to show you if you do have the camera and, or if you don't, and you're thinking about getting it, I just wanted to show you how easy it is to set up. And it is very simple to set up and it goes right on your phone, right on an app. And um, the WeWa actually has it. Uh, once the system is registered, it'll go to them and it'll see you know, that that camera number is registered and then they'll send you out any updates or anything like that. So it is, it is very uh, communicative with that so far is you know, what we have found. Uh, but we'll uh, definitely keep, keep you guys posted and be looking, you know, maybe two or three more weeks. We're gonna try to do some tests uh, in regards to that and then post the videos of what we found and the videos of anywhere we were at and the camera working and try to get those videos to you just so you can kind of see and see what the, the video quality looks like. So we'll see you on the next video.